Ah, desperate people do desperate things. Ah, the desperation coming out in the Middle Age. Old women of the view, the view, the view, attacking beautiful Melania Trump, saying that she isn't who she says she is. She's a stunt double. They're comparing and contrasting. She doesn't have the same nose. That's not her face. She's too short. So the, so the, so the, the, the jealousy of the women. I'm going to tell you the psychology behind it. Conti is going to reveal the psychology behind the Me Too attacks on Melania. Right? And I'm going to give you some. I'm going to give you guys advice. I'm going to give you guys election advice from uh, from 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 my from my amazing experience. And, and how, how famous I am now and how important I am and how much my opinion has sway. Right? So in the meantime, uh, become kindly, this is a people-powered station, kindly become a Patreon of this channel. Uh, that's how we, that's how I do it, right? It's all, it's, uh, I know people used to think I was a spy and a, and a CIA agent, but really I'm just a regular guy, like I said, right from the beginning. And uh, here I am doing this, uh, doing this channel, bringing you the truth, bringing you the daily the news on a daily basis. See some of my top stories. Do me a favor, hit this button right here. You see this right here? You hit that there, right? And you, and you end up at the Patreon page. And then you become a Patreon, right? We're at, we got a couple more. Thank you very much. Uh, I think two joined yesterday. And also a few of you were uh, sent via PayPal. I'm not going to say names because I don't know if people... <laughs> want to be affiliated, you know, have their name on the record. But uh, thank you very much. You could also, um, if you want to do that one-time payment, you hit the PayPal link and you fill in a, a, an amount and send it. Thank you very much. So let's jump into this uh, story. So we got the view, right? Here's the view. Attacking Melania Trump, the stunt double. This is the new one. Now, they did this a year ago. This is not new. This is not new conspiracy theory. They're running the same old line, but they're doing it again. So here we go. Melania online conspiracy theory is back. <laughs> Some people think that the first lady is using an imposter to stand in for her. You mean there are two women that have to pretend they're listening to him? <laughs> <laughs> Take a look at the photos that are being posted. That was a good line, right? Two women that have to, that was a good fucking line. Old lady got a fucking, got a jab in there, a jab into the Trump. Oh, see, fucking, is he going to fold? Is he going to come back and say, you old fucking, you old fag hag, sandy ass, sandy pussy ass fucking motherfucker. Right? Well, you should fucking come back in, right? What do you think? <laughs> you know, my thing. That one does not look like her. Sorry. I wasn't going to go along with this, but that one in that picture doesn't look I know. like her. You weren't going to go, now you will. No, it's a different shaped face. Well, my thing is, oh. you know, I spent like an, I, I, I'm ashamed to say, I, I spent like an hour on, on Saturday <laughs> involved fair. in this. That's fair. Melania is no. a very oh. tall, statuesque woman. And the one that we saw, uh, the first one that we showed, oh. she's, she looks kind of short. Uh, not this one, but that one. Well, look how short she looks. Trump she might tall. have been wearing Trump is tall. Flat. But she's she's like yeah. toe to toe with the them. The interesting almost. thing is it does it catches on because when there's a rumor like this and memes all over the place, I think it catches on because there's an element of truth to the idea that she doesn't want to spend time with him. Well, look. <laughs> oh, and that is the essence of the the the, the whole thing right there. The older woman saying that 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 he doesn't that she doesn't want to spend time with him because he's the orange monster. He right? That is so revealing. Listen. The truth to the idea that she doesn't want to spend time with him. Well, look. <laughs> and that's not it. That's not. That's the essence of the theory. That's the essence of her theory, right? There's no evidence of it. It's just that it's emotion. It's the Me Too emotional nonsense, right? So let's just. So that's the essence of the theory. That's the. The, the evidence behind the conspiracy theory. He just doesn't want to spend time with her. <laughs> and the other well, way. It's also, we are in a, right, political reality right now is so absurd mm -hmm. that you would almost believe anything. I think this is crazy and it's absurd, and it's also funny, and we need to laugh. For me, the laughing part is a coping mechanism. If you have not gone to hashtag fake Melania, you oh, must man. go see those, you know, those... those I, I went there. There's nothing really to see, but check this one out. So... That was uh, a few days ago, but this is a year ago. This is, uh, what is the date? 
October 19, 2017, right? So check this shit out. Right now, over this video, which some people insist is not actually Melania. <laughs> My wife, Melania, who happens to be right here, finds that subject to be of such vital importance and she's very much involved. And as you know, she's on the committee and really wants to be involved in that process. That's not Melania. <laughs> That's the wrong nose. The girl has a different nose. I don't know. <laughs> Last night. So, so this saying, the, the, the point of the, the, the thing is that the view, the women of the view are saying, oh, there's this conspiracy theory. But they started the conspiracy theory. They're the ones who are plugging it and promoting it. Wow, and Melania doesn't shake her head like that. So you don't think she just stands silent? She has something on her nose right there. There's some kind of, there's some kind of glasses support of some something. The other thing to remember about rich women is that she Melania Trump spends how many you know thousands of dollars and how many hours in a salon, you know the finest salons in New York City, working her face. Right, so they're they're technically is a lot of versions of the same Melania. Uh, a different makeup can make you look like a totally different person. You know what I mean? Like, and especially if at that caliber of, uh, you know, makeupologist or whatever it's called, right? So, uh, you know, women are vain too. Oh, I, I you know, and then they, they're one day they're, they're seen without their makeup. Uh, that's two things, I mean, personally, I, I've never gotten. One is makeup. And the other is high heels. I don't know how the hell fucking women wear high heels, man. I did it in a band once with, with heels, and I'm telling you, man, your fucking legs are killing you. I don't get it. I don't, I don't think that that's her nose. Do we see? Let's see the, the two again. Look at her nose. Well, maybe it's a shadow. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> I don't know. Wow. Did, you hear the, did you hear the pathetic women in the audience? Oh, oh. You know, the well, Secret Service says that they don't use body doubles, that that's not a... Well, I, don't, I don't know if they would tell us anyway, exactly, but... It's like in the movie Dave. That's right. There were two But presents. this is going to extremes to not be near him. <laughs> to get a body double. <laughs> <laughs> I mean... <laughs> I had a body double, right? It's got two of them, two women. That's what, That was the implication. That was the dig. That really... <laughs> well, this is on the heels of the, the sunglasses conspiracy, why they were yeah. born... These allegations almost always come from undesirable women. Ugh. And all day long. And at night, too. And, yeah, yeah, she wears them. I would, I'm such a hypocrite, though, because I hate political conspiracies. Ooh. I used to get such stuff all the time. She, ugh. Ugh. Look at you, you fucking you fatty, McCainy, fucking fatty. You're fatty. Nobody wants you, man. Nobody wants you. About, like, this why man. Hillary Clinton wore blue sunglasses. And last night I was like, is this her? Was <laughs> Yeah. You want to punch her, right? And so here's another one. Here's uh, another to continue. And we'll look at some pictures. I, I mean, I don't know. Let's not. Let's rule it out. Is it true? Is it not true? There's some. I mean, it, there's some pictures where Melania Trump looks different. So we'll explore those. Get your bass on. Throughout, through and through. First of all, if they're going to use body doubles, right? They're not going to use it on close ups. They're going to use it like, you know, a body double drives around in a car, a fake car, you know, like a diversion vehicle or something. Or, boards a plane from a distance, but there's no way they're going to let the cameras get close up on a body double. I mean, that's a basic Hollywood trick. Right? If you're going to use a body double for safety or to, as a stunt double, 
you know, you never you never zero in on the face. So the idea that the, that any of the images that the White House would let slip out of Melania Trump, uh, you know, close up is it's just that's not believable, right? So here's some here's some other images. I mean, you know, what? How many more images we want to look at? It's fucking images all over the place, right? I don't know. I don't know. You got. You can. You can. You can sift through these, right? There's tons of pictures of Melania Trump. I don't know. I'm not. I'm not buying it. You know what I'm saying? I'm not buying. It. Here's the latest one, right? This is the one we just saw. That this isn't Trump. This isn't Melania. It does look different. She looks a, a little more exotic. But th- again, she's always wearing sunglasses, and now her eyes look a little closer together. Who even knows if that shot is real? You know, the shot could be. The shot could be. Uh, photoshopped right so i'm gonna tell you what this is all about i'm gonna tell you what this whole thing is about you want to see something all right so here we go i'm gonna give you the i'm gonna give you what's really going on behind the the urge to prove that trump is a is a two-timer he has two melanias the 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 confusion right that there's no there's no more ground to stand on right here me too this is the me too people right and now if this is this is this is the, right, the fear. Not Trump, anything but Trump, Trump, oh, fucking but Trump, right? And, and who's doing, who has to do the threatening, right? It's not the Trump people, because the, the, the Hillary people don't give a shit about the Trump people. Ah, the Bernie bros. You see this up here? You see Bernie? Right? See, if Bernie wants to win, Bernie already has the independence. He's already got it. 40% of the country is going to swing independent, and vote for Bernie to get rid of Trump because Trump's an imbecile on the economy, right? The trade deficits, the the you know the immigration blunders, all of his all of his failures, right, are are, are now coming true. Mostly economic failures. I like what he's done in terms of the media, but his economic failures are 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 mounting and they're they're piling up, right? And he wants to cut Medicaid and Medicare. That guy is crazy, right? So you got to get rid of him, right? So so Bernie. Bernie, if you're listening, Bernie bros, all you got to do is say to the Hillary people, the Me Too's is, you don't want Trump, do you? Right? Vote Bernie. Right? Anything else but Bernie. Right? No uh, Beto O'Rourke, no shit sandwich Joe, Joe Biden, no fake uh, Kamala Harris. If, if it's going to be Elizabeth Warren, she's a VP, possible. If it's going to be Tulsi Gabbard, she doesn't have the name recognition, so it's going to be a possible VP or Secretary of the Defense, Secretary of State. These are all good picks, right? So, so that's what's going on, right? That's the essence of of the attack to Melania, right? It's fear. It's, it's stupid women, right? Mostly, right? This is a good one. Oh my God, James Comey threw the election to Trump. He needs to be fired. You remember this? Look at the fucking faces. Then, a few months later, oh my God, President Trump just fired James Comey. He's a, he's as terrible as Nixon. <laughs> Crazy, right? It's all emotion. This is the point. They they it's a it's an emotional vote, right? Keep fighting, or we'll end up with crooked Hillary as president, right? You got to remember that. That's uh, I I know it's it's hard. Oh, it's it's like like butt hurt, right? You guys fucking love that word, butt hurt. Like your ass is hurting from from getting butt pounded, right? Is that what that is? Butt hurt, right? You guys are butt hurt. The Trump people are butt hurt because you. First of all, your your man is failing, and the other thing is is the revelation that most people are only supporting Trump, right, to destroy the Democratic Party and get rid of Hillary. Just remember that. Swallow that and understand that. That the the point of Trump was was like a like a Molotov cocktail bomb, right? So just understand understand who Trump was in 2016 and why people celebrated him beating the crooked Democrats for however he did it. Who the hell knows? Ah memories. Oh Jesus. The Jesus Trump. Right? Fucking the idol. He's the idol. Idol worship. But really, that's who he is. He's a fucking coward, man. This guy's a coward. So is Melania real or fake? I don't know. What do you think? I think that, uh, you know what I'm saying? Like, I think you know what I mean? It's stupid, right? It's fucking stupid. It's a stupid story. I know. I'm sorry. 
but it's uh it was fun to explore let's see if the view the view lets up but they're not man because they got no ground man they're, they're nervous they're, they're, they're desperate just roll for fucking sanders man get sanders universal single payer health care you've got a you got a a revolutionary transformative uh president at the top in terms of uh, foreign policy. You won't have no Venezuela or Syria. He'll follow the Constitution, right? Economically, transformative, transformative uh, president at the top, transforming the economy back to a people-powered economy. So, wake up, Marcus County reporting.